Bloober team handling of mental health is also very poor, which is what Silent Hill 2 is about. Ugh, don't spoil it. It's a fucking 25-year-old game. So, I will say, Silent Hill 2 has an amazing story. As long as they keep the story intact, I don't really care what they do with, like, the visuals or anything like that. They just need to keep the writing one-to-one. -one. That story is timeless. Things are subtropical. Sweat physics, let's go. That's huge. Mm -hmm. Could she really be here? Waiting for me? Mary died of that damn disease. Things are the prime ago. cake. dreams I see that town I think this looks good so far Silent Hill like visually obviously I haven't seen any like gameplay I just mean visually it actually looks next gen as opposed to just like an HD remaster Goodness. Oh, don't do it. I don't need you anymore. Is it Silent Hill 2 that has the um, UFO dog controlling the whole thing ending? Or is that Silent Hill 3? I think it's Silent Hill 2. One of the endings is you can walk into like the command center and it's a dog pressing buttons controlling the game. It's pretty hype. Oh, it is too? Nice. Mary? You know what? I actually just remembered what they were whining about. Because it's PlayStation exclusive. Well, for consoles. Because it's not coming to Xbox. Now I remember what they were whining about. PS4 people were mad as well. Were they? Is it only PS5? Do they not have it, like, backwards with PS4 or anything? I only saw Xbox. No, it's only PlayStation 5. Ah, okay. Well, then just get it on Steam. I don't even think you can get a PlayStation 5. Isn't that shit still sold out? There's a, That's like finding a shiny Pokemon. They have never made enough PS5s for sale. <laughs> 